Hi, I'm Denise Austin, and welcome to Fit and Light. Today we're exercising at the desert in California at the La Quinta Resort and Club at their PJ West, which is a beautiful golf course. Let's begin our workout. Starting with your feet about hip width apart, make them a little further, place your arms out, have your wrists in line with your ankles if you can, and let's slowly begin a nice turnout for a triangle position. And slowly bring your arm up. Good morning, everybody. We're gonna wake up that spine, get energized for the day, have wonderful, wonderful attitude. That's right. Great. Today we're gonna do a cardio light program for our aerobic activity to make it low impact. Then we're gonna work on our legs, our hips and our thighs, our anti-aging workout. And then finish it off with some energizing yoga. Hook your, your thumbs right in front of you, lift them up, turn to the side, bend your knee and take it flat down. Stretch out the legs and lift back up and hold. That's it, can you hold it there? Inner thigh stretch. Wonderful. To the other side. Hook right here at the thumbs. Lift your arms up. Bend your front knee. And hold. Pull your body upward. Feel the rib cage lifting. So each vertebrae has a lot of space between. Them. It's healthy for your back. Hold it up there. And relax. Hold the stretch. Good, and slowly now come forward. Let's do a forward bend. Do the best you can. Feel the stretch. Notice that my back is straight. If you're just starting out, please bend your knees to protect your back. And lift up with the straight back, lift up. Wonderful, good work. Okay, and stretch your arms to the side and to the other side. And stretch. It's a great day. You're going to feel your body having more energy today because you're circulating the blood right away. For 18 years, I've gotten up in the morning and got my exercise done right away. It feels so good. And you're ready for the day. You can take it on. That's it. And stretch up. Stretch your shoulders back. Shoulders way back. Feel the body reaching. Squeeze the buttock muscles. Stretch up. Lift up and to the other side. Stretch it up. Stretch up. Oh, it feels wonderful. Stretch. Elongate the spine. Lengthen your back. And relax. Relax your neck now. Go in half circles, reducing any tension that you would have throughout the night. That's it. Maybe your neck is stiff today. Do these stretches throughout the day. If you work, do them a couple times during the day. That's it. And now shoulders and shoulders. Release the tension through the shoulder blades. That's it, shoulders. Great. Shoulders all the way, full circles. Go get your shoes on. I'll be right back for Cardio Light. It's time for our cardio light to do low impact aerobics. Easy on the joints, easy on the back, and you could still burn fat. So let's get started. March in place. Always start with a good march in place to really get the body pumping up. That's right, come on, you can do it. Isn't it a beautiful desert, that blue sky out there? Feel as though you're right here with me at La Quinta. They have a new spa here, which is beautiful. You can take wonderful hikes up those mountains. That's it. If you're really into hiking, which I love to do. Let's begin with a little cha-cha. Side, cha-cha. Side, cha-cha. That's it. Good. It's a little fun. Remember, you're right there at your own house. Just relax. Feel loose. That's it. You can dance right there without anyone making fun of you, right? Good. 
My kids always laugh at me when I do stuff like this. And then they get up and they try it themselves, so it's kind of fun. Good. Side. Good. That's it. Little samba. Come on. Good. That's it. You're doing it. Come on. Enjoy yourself. That's the key. Having fun. Fun and fitness goes hand in hand. Yes. Good music. Just dance. Let loose. Good. That's it. Side. Good. Side. You're doing great. That's it. Keep moving. That's the key. Great. Side. Good. Get down there now. Good. Push. That's it. Side. And side. Good. Push that arm. Use those arms. Strengthen the arms. Yes. Nice sexy arm. Push. Use the muscles. That's it. Great. Good. Two more. Last one. Now hold it. Hold it. Good. What we're going to do is take a walk forward. Here we go. Ready? And go. Good. That's it. To the other side. Good. Just enjoy yourself. Let loose. Good. You got it. Use the body. Great. That's it. Woo. Little southwest here. Good. In California. The beautiful desert. We're right outside Palm Springs, California. That's it. It's nice and dry. Good. That's great. Now, shake it a little. Come on. Just walk. Good. That's it. Good. Just use the space you have in your house. Even if it's a small apartment, look, you could still work out. So don't make any excuses. Aerobic exercise really helps. Burns fat. Burns calories. Burns off that extra dessert you might have had last night. Like I did. Ooh. Gotta burn it off. Good. Two more. But I sure enjoyed it. If you're gonna eat it, enjoy it. Save your every bite. Okay, last one. Now side to side. Good. Use the legs. That's it. Good. Touch. Tap. Great. Have a good time. Yes. Smile. We're burning fat now. Good. That's it. Work those arms. Work the legs. All in one motion. That's it. Take it back. Good. Great. Two more. The last one and switch sides. Ready, march it out. Ready and touch, touch back. Good. You're doing fabulously. Just move that body. Burn those calories. Yes. Boost the metabolism, that's the key. If you do exercise with me for this half an hour, guess what? You can keep your metabolism up, up to two hours after we're done together. And if you do the whole hour, guess what? It'll stay up to almost four hours. So try the whole hour with me if you can. Come on, give it all you got. Good, try your hardest, 110%. How do you feel? Feel on a scale of one to 10. I want you to be about a six. Good. Last one. Okay, shake it out. Think about your knees now. Pull up your knees, think about the abs. Your back straight. Great. Always think good posture. Pull in the abs, pull in your stomach, belly button in, belly button in. That's it. Good. Keep your back straight. That's the key to this exercise. Good. Pick up the arms now, come on. The more you use the muscles, the more calories you burn. Get as many exercises done at once. Right here, we're tightening the tummy. We're working on the legs. At the same time, we're burning fat. That's right. Good, always breathe. Whew. Getting that oxygen, the rich supply of oxygen to every cell. So breathe. That's it. You need all that oxygen to give you that energy, that vitality. That's right. Good. Keep it going and I'll be right back. Today we're gonna work on our hips and thighs to get a great lower body. Make it your better half. 
Welcome to the anti-aging workout. Today we're concentrating on our hips and thighs to firm up the lower half. So let's begin. Standing up nice and tall, let's work on those thighs. Take it down and lift up. Take it down and out. This is now working on the outer hips and the outer thighs. Excellent exercise. Take it down slightly, lift that leg out. Good, that's it, stretch it out. Beautiful. This really works on that whole sides of the legs. No more saddlebags, we'll firm it all up. That's right, you'll have beautiful, sexy legs you've always wanted. That's right, if you do these exercises, you can do them, I know you can. It just takes a little effort, and you will see results in about six weeks if you're exercising at least three times a week with me. Great. I feel as though I'm your personal trainer coming right to your house to teach you specific exercises that you need to really help feel young, get energized, and also target the hips and the thighs right now. So your stomach is in and you're really lifting that leg using right here the hips and your thighs. Excellent exercise. We've got a couple more. Think about your abs. Are they pulled in? Always contract them in. Your natural tummy tuck. Just by doing it naturally, pulling in. Last one. Beautiful. And turn to the side. Take it down for a lunge. Take it down and lift it up. Down and up. This is now working the whole leg, the entire thigh. The front, the back, the inner thigh, every part of your thighs. For those of you this is too hard on your knees, make sure you just go halfway down. Look, that's good enough. You're still contracting these muscle groups. That's it, great. Back is straight. Notice that front knee stays in a 90 degree angle. Very important. Never go like this, Sami, because look at that knee. That's too much pressure on the kneecap. Just go straight down, straight down. You're also getting a wonderful lengthening of your front of your thigh here. We got two more on this side. Last one. Wow, I can feel it. Okay, let's turn to the other side. Take it down and lift it up. You want to push through the back heel here. Push up through the heel. Keep your stomach in, keep your back straight. Think good body alignment. Readjust your alignment to make sure you're in the right position. Good. You know, technique is very important. And I really concentrate on this for you because it makes a world of difference. You see the different shape to the body, the nice contours. You see the results better if you're doing it correctly. Make every minute count. And that's the effect here. You really want to make it work for you. I don't want you to waste your time. This one doesn't. This one really works. Take it down and press it up. We've got two more. Come on, you can do it. Last one. Wonderful. Now shake it out. Now let's work the inner thighs inside your legs. No more jigglies. No more tapioca pudding looking legs. <laughs> That's right. We'll firm it up. A great way to firm up your inner thighs and the outer thighs. Area we all need, right? Yes. That's where my fat goes. I don't know about you, but it does deposit there. Most women do. Your hips and thighs. Genetically, we are predisposed to get our fat there. So if you're actually trying to lose weight, you gotta do the aerobic activity and then specific exercises like these. Okay, last one and stand up, beautiful. Now let's begin working a little more of the thighs. Lift your legs straight and down. Lift straight and down. Try that one, lift straight and down. Now we're working on the front of those knee areas, so nothing will droop there. Especially when I hit 40, that's the area I saw that started to change on me and I was like, ooh, I gotta start working on that area. And I really do think these exercises make a difference, keeping you young and vital and able throughout the rest of your life to make it a habit. That's my goal for you. Make exercise a daily habit. Even if it's 10 minutes, it's still great for you. I promise you, you'll see some results in just 10 minutes. 
My goal is for you to do the whole half an hour though. Stay tuned, I'll be right back with a great tip. Welcome to Energizing Yoga. Now it's time to quiet the mind and stretch the body. Let's begin. Taking a great, good, deep breath. Inhale, cleanse the breath, and exhale. Beautiful. Try with the energizing yoga, breathing in through the nose and out the nose. Beautiful, that's it. And stretch the body up and a triangle. Hold that body, lift up. It's a beautiful day. Try to go out and make it your best day. Think of that each and every day. Because God gave us one life and one body. Take good care of it and have a wonderful time. That's right. Lift up, stomach in, and to the other side. Just slowly reach your hand down your leg. Lift up. Great. Hold that position. You can do it. Stretching feels so good for you. I love it. Lift all the way up. That's it. And now turn the leg out and come down here if you can. Hold here if you're just starting out. This is where I want you to stay. Hold the foot in the back here too. Lift your arm up if possible. Your ultimate goal is to reach your hand behind you and lift up. This is the advanced triangle. This is a wonderful exercise. Energizes your body, yet calms the mind. And lift up. It's gentle on your body. Turn your toes, turn out. Lean into it. Relax first if you're at step one. Step two would be here. And step three would be all the way down. That's it. Just do the best that you can. Remember, always try your best. Never jerk. Just stretch with calmness. That's it. Lift up. Great. And stretch your arms and shoulders to the side. Hold that stretch. Try to turn your hips even. That's it. Turn your hips. Good. This is called the warrior. It shows how proud you are. Confidence. And arms out if you can. This is level two and this would be level three. Do what you can. Great. Lift up. Turn your toes to the other side. Turn your hips also. Bend the knee. Not too deep now. This is level one, this is level two, and this is level three. Exalted warrior. Hold. With regular practice, you'll be able to do some of this. That's right. Good, and walk your legs together. Relax your hips now. Circle through the hips. That's it, all the way around. Discover all the beautiful benefits of exercise. That's right. Once you start feeling good about yourself, it just becomes natural as a daily habit of exercise. A fit and light program is easy enough that everybody can do. Stay tuned for Denise's daily wisdom and get tips from around the house. loves the soothing atmosphere of a luxurious spa, but when time or money is tight, you can create your own spa right at home. It's important to take time out to relax, and an oatmeal bath is a great way to relieve stress. Reducing stress is so important for maintaining your physical and mental health. For your relaxing oatmeal bath, start by putting two cups of oatmeal in a clean pair of pantyhose. Then you place it underneath the faucet and make your bath. Put a few candles around the tub for that extra spa touch. 
And as you sit in the bath, the starches from the oatmeal will seep into the water and moisturize your skin. Your friends will think you've been to a real spa, but I'll keep your secret. Remember, strong bodies, strong minds, because you are worth it.